Hello, everyone, and welcome to your 15-minute full body reclined stretch. My name is Caitlin, and today all that you will need is enough space to recline comfortably on your back body. Begin to make your way there and hug both knees up in towards your chest. A little sway and cradle to the right and to the left. Nothing is erratic, and nothing is meant to feel rushed. Just use this time to close your eyes and start to connect to your breath. Hug your right knee in towards your chest and let your left leg go long the length of your mat. And as you inhale, straighten your right leg. And on your exhale, rebend your right knee. Inhale, right leg straight. And exhale, right knee bent. Inhale, straight right leg. And exhale to bend your right knee. Inhale, straighten, and exhale to bend. Inhale, your right leg is straight, and exhale to bend your right knee. Inhale, right leg straight, any amount, hold right there, and then continue to breathe. Small refinements, please unclench your jaw. And then we'll meet in figure four, cross your right ankle over your left thigh, Option to interlace your fingers on left hamstrings. If that's really intense, though, release the bind and bring your left foot back to the mat. If your left foot is lifted, option to extend your left heel up towards the ceiling or towards the sky. Then a few times on your own, just bend and extend through the left knee, introducing some space and length in your left hamstrings. All while your shoulders are grounded, Your right foot is flexed, and you experience sensation and stretch in your outer right hip and your outer right glute muscle. With your left leg straight, you might walk your hands up your left calf muscle, left ankle, or grab the bottom of your left foot. And then press your tailbone down into the mat, into the floor, as you draw a deep breath in. And a complete breath out. Slow to release. Hug your right knee back to your chest. And let your left leg go long the length of your space. And just imagine your right knee in this windshield wiper motion. Right knee towards your right shoulder. And then pull it across your torso over towards your left ribs or left chest. And just do that a few times to the right and to the left in that windshield wiper motion. Massaging your right hip crease. Neck is soft, head is heavy. And funnel a deep breath into your right hip crease. Exhale, spinal twist. Guide your right leg all the way to the ground at your left. Then bring your attention into your right arm. Pull it down towards your outer right hip. Inhale, sweep your right arm high. It's like a half snow angel. And on your exhale, lower your right arm. So work into your right shoulder. Inhale, right arm high, that snow angel shape. And exhale to lower your right hand and your right arm. A few more times. Inhale, right arm high. Sensation without rush. And exhale to lower your right arm. Inhale, right arm high. Feel your right bicep just hug in towards the right side of your space. Feel your right bicep hug in towards the right side of your face. And simultaneously draw your outer right hip down. And through the length of your right side body, your waist, your rib tissue, and your armpit hollow, take a wide breath in. Exhale, unwind, and return to center. Give your right knee a solo squeeze, and then pull it really wide into a half happy baby pose. On your inhale, straighten your right leg. It's a diagonal line from hip to heel. And on your exhale, rebend your right knee. Do that a few more times so you're a little more familiar. Inhale, you would straighten your right leg. And exhale, half happy baby pose. You bend into your right knee. A little bit of tightness, maybe some soreness. 
but nothing is meant to be jarring or jamming to the framework of your body. The next time your right leg is straight on that diagonal line, hold and breathe. Press the back of your left hip down, left butt cheek into the floor. And from your right hip crease all the way out through your right heel, take a big breath in. And a complete breath out. Just as you are, one more inhalation. And on your exhale, release and take a full body stretch. Now work into banana pose. Walk your hands and your heels over to the left side of your space. Cross your right ankle over your left. And then focus on your right arm, right shoulder. Come back to those snow angel motions. You lower your right hand towards your outer right hip. And then bring your right arm back up, right bicep towards your right temple or right ear. And just do that up and down motion a few times. Massaging your right shoulder. Inviting some small, intentional movements through your right fingers. Maybe you alive in your right wrist. And the next time your right arm is lifted, let your left hand grab a hold of your right wrist. If that's too much or too deep, then just simply release the bind and take something that would best suit you. Just about five counts, your left side body is short, but your right side spacious, long, and stretched. Direct to your right waist, that space between your right hip and your low right ribs. Take a wide breath in, feel the stretch across your skin. And on your exhale, release. Your hands and your heels return to center and hug both knees up into your chest. There is no expectation, but you may find a little more freedom in your right hip crease. Recall that soothing sway to the right and to the left. Acknowledge that you're safe. Acknowledge that you can breathe. And then we move on to second side. So you're a little more familiar. Hug your left knee in towards your chest and let your right leg go along the length of your space. Inhale, you straighten your left leg up towards your ceiling and exhale to rebend your left knee. Inhale, left leg straight. Be kind, be curious, and exhale, bend your left knee. Take the next few rounds, your rhythm, your pace. On an inhalation, your left leg extends. And on your exhalation, your left knee bends. And the next time your left leg is straight, hold and stay there. Press your tailbone, your low back into the mat. With that effort, take a deep breath in and a complete breath out. Breathing with and through any tightness or any soreness. And we'll meet in figure four across left ankle over right thigh. You can interlace your fingers on right hamstrings or keep your right foot grounded. If you have the interlace of your fingers, option to inhale and kick your right heel up. It's a little more hamstring length, and on your exhale, re-bend your right knee. Your rhythm, your pace, but keep your shoulders grounded and keep your jaw spacious. Aware of your right toes, aware of your outer left hip. And whether the sensation is really loud or a little more subtle, Just watch your breathing. The next time your right leg is lifted and straight, keep it that way. An option to slide your hands up, grab your right ankle, or maybe your right calf. Actively press your low back and tailbone down. Maintain integrity. And to your expression of figure four, take a big breath in. Exhale to release. Let your right leg go along the length of your mat and hug left knee to chest. 
those minimal windshield wiper motions, you sway your left knee out towards your outer left shoulder and then back in across your chest. Just a few times to the right and to the left. Massaging through left hip crease. And the next time your left knee is wide, funnel a deep breath in. Exhale, spinal twist, guide your left leg over to the right. Stack your hips. And then with the left arm, you have your snow angel motions. Left arm high, bicep towards ear. And then left arm is low, palm towards your low back or buttocks. Alive through your left fingers and aware of your left shoulder. Take your time to get there. But the next time your left arm is high, bicep towards ear, maybe it's your elbow towards your temple, just hold and breathe there. Grounded through the back of your left shoulder, long through your left side body. And acknowledge that space between your left hip and your left ribs. Take a breath in. And exhale to unwind, release to center. Your left knee gets that solo squeeze, then pull wide into a half happy baby pose. As your left knee flares wide, start to extend your left leg any amount and then rebend into your half happy baby. It's a little more inner thigh focus, hamstring and hip focus. The next time your left leg is straight, hold and pull it wide. Acknowledge that diagonal from your left hip crease out through your left heel. Maybe you take your left hand to your calf muscle, ankle, or the bottom of your left foot. And just press the back of your right hip down. Precisely as you are, feel your whole body breathe in. Exhale to release and find your full body stretch. Banana pose or your C curve, walk hands and heels over to the right. Cross your left ankle over your right. Remember your snow angel on the left side. Lower your left palm towards your outer left hip. And then sweep your left arm sweetly high bicep towards the ear. Just work that up and down motion a few times. Without the clench in your jaw or strain in your brows. Take your time to get there, but the next time your left arm is lifted, keep it there. And then let your right hand grab a hold of your left wrist. Practice a wider breath. Left side body, rib tissue, and armpit hollow. To the C curve of your spine, take a big breath in. Exhale to release, come to center, and hug both knees in towards your chest. Let your feet find the mat. Feet about hips width distance, 10 toes forward. Inhale, bridge pose. Lift your hips and lengthen arms overhead. Exhale, lower your hips and lower your hands. A few more. Inhale, bridge. Arms elongate overhead. Exhale, lower your hips and lower your hands. Inhale, bridge pose. Heart up to the chin and exhale to lower down. Inhale to your bridge pose. Continue to breathe and hold that lift of your hips for a count of five, four, three, two, and one. Lower your hips, hug your knees to your chest, and then rock and roll the length of your spine. Join me upright in your comfortable seat. Take a deep breath in and open mouth exhale to release. And that will conclude your full body stretch. I hope that you enjoyed and found benefit from slowing down, connecting to your body. Be kind to yourself and be kind to others. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.